as I said, I'm proper naive, yeah? A lot of people in the workplace, yeah? No matter what you work, you can work construction, you can work in an office in London, yeah? I'm naive to this shit, yeah? A lot of people, they do cocaine, yeah? Like, I was shocked. At my last workplace, yeah, there was a little sweet, innocent, light-skinned mixed race girl, yeah? One of my colleagues told me, you know she sniffs cocaine? I said, you joke me. You joke me. You lie. I couldn't believe it. She sniffs cocaine. I was shocked. Yeah. Gal told me, yeah, she's gone in the toilet, see them sniffing lines, of, yeah, on the fucking, maybe in the, inside the cubicle or something like that. I was shocked. Shocked. Trust me, there's a lot of people around us. They, 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 they take drugs and they just hide it. Yeah, they, they act like they ain't on nothing. They on, they on some shit. They on some shit. But I tell you now, yeah, there's no way I'll be with a girl who does drugs. Yeah? I don't even want to be with a girl who smokes a cigarette. Yeah? I've had girls around me before, and yeah, before you come see me, you're not allowed to smoke that day. Yeah, fuck smoke, not smoking for an hour or two. You ain't allowed to smoke that day, innit? Yeah? If I pick up anything from you, gone. I don't want no girl smoking around me. Yeah. <laughs> I've even had to walk out on a girl yeah, who, who, who was smoking in my presence. Yeah? And I had to pull up girls a couple of times as well for smoking in my presence. One girl, the first time I had to walk out on a girl or pull up a girl on smoking in my presence, and I actually made a video about this, um, actually, yeah, Nadia was in the back of that video, actually, as well. Um, seeing one girl, one, one, one light skin thing, she used to live, um, she probably still lives there now, Green Lanes, Hornsey sides, um, near Finsley Park. Uh, went to her yard one time, and she's uh, smoking a cigarette, but she lives above a shop, so it's going to be too long for her to go downstairs or whatever and smoke. So she's bust the window open, she's smoking the cigarette, blowing out the window, and it, yeah, cool, boom. What happens is girls get comfortable around a certain man or whatever in it, yeah, and they start to push their boundaries or whatever in it. Yeah? So that was that day. The next time I went to her yard, she's smoking a cigarette, but she ain't hanging her head out of the window. She ain't respecting my presence. She ain't respecting the fact that, you know, Jays are non-smokers, so non-smokers typically hate smoking, yeah? They don't like smoke, yeah? She ain't respecting my presence. So boom. So she starts smoking in the room without busting the window or nothing like that, innit? Yeah. So I'm lying on her sofa or whatever, innit? Yeah. And I say, what, do you mind smoking the cigarette outside the window, innit? She said, why? I said, I don't smoke. Yeah, and she was like, yeah, all right. I was like, yo, smoke the cigarette and blow it outside the window, innit? She's like, no, it's my house, innit? I just got up, put on my trainers and out the door, innit, yeah? I'm all taking a look up, yeah, in the alleyway, yeah, before I jump in my car, and yeah. I see this girl come run out. <laughs> I'm like, what? And she was like, oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, please be, come back to the come back to the flat. Yeah, yeah. I'm not sitting around no one who smokes. Yeah. Even when I was an electrician, I used to go to certain people's houses, and nine times out of ten, if the people smoke in the house, I say, listen, do you mind not smoking? Yeah, like I don't smoke, yeah. I know it's not my house, but it doesn't matter. If I'm in your house, whether I'm a guest or a fucking electrician, you should respect my presence, innit? I don't smoke, yeah? Don't smoke in my presence. Even if it's not my house, yeah? You're gonna, you need to respect my presence, so I ain't gonna be around you. I don't go to anyone's houses who smoke, yeah? And if I do go to someone's house, like family member's house who, who smokes, if I don't like it, I'm gonna say something. If they don't wanna listen to me, I'm leaving. And we're going to fall out. Yeah? I'm not going to keep my mouth shut just to keep the peace. Now, obviously, if I go to a local function and there's all bear man and bear gal up in, in the yard smoking or whatever, and get, well, I'll probably know, I'll pre the situation, I'll know, okay, these are going to smoke in the house, whatever, in it, yeah? So I don't want to fight all six, seven, eight people, whatever, in it. So it's either I put up with it or maybe try and go in the room and stay as far away from it as possible, or I don't go to the function. Yeah? But, yeah, people for respect man's presence, innit? I don't smoke. So, I don't want people smoking around me, whether it's in my house, your house, Buckingham Palace, it don't fucking matter, innit? I don't like smoke.
And next time, um, yeah, one girl actually tried to get rude to man on the phone, actually. Um, went to go meet this girl uh, in Chingford, which is next to Edmonton, and um, she was a bit late or whatever, innit? Yeah. So, boom. So, I thought to myself, all right, fuck it. I ain't standing around hanging, waiting for this girl. And it, I left and went back to my house. And then she pulled up to the spot we were supposed to meet at. And she was like, oh, where are you? Innit? I said, I've gone home. And she was like, wow. I was like, listen, you taking 10 minutes. You know, I ain't waiting around for you for 10 minutes. Innit? Yeah, you need to come to my yard, innit? So she came to my road, whatever, innit? Yeah? and jumped in the car. And obviously, I stuck it on her because she tried to shout at me on the phone. Innit? I stuck it on her on the phone. And I stuck it on her when I got in the car with her as well. Yeah? Anyway, we gone around the corner, just chilling or whatever, innit? Yeah. My girl backs out a cigarette. Yeah, trying to spark the cigarette or whatever, innit? I was like, no, you can't smoke that around me. She's like, what do you mean, innit? I was like, listen, I don't smoke, yeah? So you can't smoke that cigarette around me. She's like, what if I wind down the window? I said, no. I told her to get out of her own car to smoke that cigarette. Yeah? And she did. She had to, innit? Because I would have got out and left. I would have went back to my yard. Yeah? Now, I didn't see that girl afterwards, and that's fine, yeah? I don't know what the reason was. Maybe it was that I stuck it on her or whatever, innit? Yeah? And I don't know. Maybe it's because I stuck it on her about the smoking cigarette. Maybe I stuck it on her because she shouted at me on the phone. It don't fucking matter, innit? Yeah? I ain't having no girl smoking my presence. Yeah? I ain't gonna, you know, lower my standards just, yeah, you know, so, so I can get this girl to bed or whatever, innit? Nah. Man, I'm at a principle, innit? Yeah? I ain't gonna allow a girl to do something that I don't want. Or I don't like just to keep this girl happy. I ain't no girl. I ain't no pleaser for a girl. I don't please girls. I ain't no simp, whatever they call it in America. 